Hello there everyone and welcome to another episode of a lot of how to's and reviews today We got a new item the bulldozer multi-surface 18 inch brush This brush is really a bulldozer. I kid you not I have a link in the description below where you be linked directly to Amazon where you can purchase this exact broom in the 24 inch version in this video I'm showing the 18 inch version that I purchased directly from Home Depot. It is about 13 14 dollars with tax so you can go there and get that if you have a Home Depot near you. However, what's linked in the description will take you to Amazon and you can get the 24 inch version for $25 plus tax. Okay, so this is an indoor and outdoor use broom bulldozer. I'm only going to use it indoors. My goal is to, you know, get rid of all these cans, put them somewhere, put them in bags. Um, this thing is a hot mess. <laughs> um, yeah, so hopefully I can do that. I don't expect it to clean the whole floor really well. I just want to, you know, organize the cans together and probably get whatever dust or grime I could get off the floor. And we'll see. We'll see how how clean we get this floor. Uh, it might take me a few days, but um, let's get to it. Okay, so it's attached with these hooks. Yeah, these hooks aren't that great though. It comes off pretty easily. So it's honestly just don't really walk around with the hooks unless you have like another cable you could wh whip around somehow, like a magnet cable or something like that, band. Um, yeah, so it comes with the hooks. It's simple. As you can see here, it's 18 inches long. There's the back for you to read. Yeah, it's a simple brush. You just get it on there. Let's put it on. Whoa. Just to let you know, you might have to apply a little bit of pressure to get this um, broom actually on the stick. I guess the groove is brand new, so uh, it's not, you know, easy to twist it on. So you have to hold it down like this. This is what I did. I held the top part down. You see? down and pride pressure and push force down onto the bottom um, and then use my other hand down here to twist the broom on and yeah it got on it didn't take much um, but at first it was a <laughs> tricky because I thought it would just screw it easily like you know those uh, other brooms but no uh, I think it'll get easier as you know keep doing it and then it'll, it'll groove it'll, the grooves will be created you know also got some little safety gear here we got from Dollar Tree it's like two dollars two fifty you know um you know just so i don't get too much dust in my mouth and my eyes and whatnot i have allergies already so i don't want to be sneezing and coughing all the place there's a whole lot of dust here so yeah just get that 250 real quick from the store yeah. so all together what i spend like 15 bucks to clean this let's see how 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 well we can do i uh, also got these gloves from dollar tree they're really good gloves, really thick. Really sh good quality, really, honestly. I didn't think the quality from Dollar Tree was good for some gloves. Um, really good. It's like only Dollar 25, so yeah, those, those two. And uh, great. Okay, let's actually see the bulldozer be put to use. One handed. All this trash, look at all this trash I'm about to move. Wow. It's really like a bulldozer. This is really good, really good broom. Really good broom. So look, look in the interior. You see how the tough bristles here? Tough bristles. On the outside you have the soft bristles, inside you have the tough bristles. This is how most of them are constructed. It's really good quality, I believe, um, for an expensive broom compared to the other brooms, which are like, Thirty dollars, twenty-five dollars. This broom is thirteen dollars. It's eighteen inches, but you don't really need much bigger. You know, just just an extra little push, and you're good to go. All right, so let me continue.
as you can see right here, it gets the moss off pretty easily. Like it just comes off like a razor to your hair. It's so easy to get the moss off. That dirt though, it's another story. I probably need a power washer, portable one. Okay, so this was great, really great actually. It did a really good job. As you see, I piled all the trash here. All the trash is piled up right here. And it's clear, it was trash literally everywhere all over this place. On this side, and this side. It's still really, really, really dusty. I'm gonna take care of that at a later time. But you see all the trash has been removed from this center and brought in a pile right over here. So yeah, we had one little incident. This came off, so I was pushing so hard and all that dirt, look at all the dust, my shoes are dusty. Shoes are really dusty. Yeah, but that came off, not a big deal. I don't really need it anyway. And I'll, you know, it's just to hook it, but I'll, I'll just stand it up somewhere in the corner. But yeah, so great, great, great. Um, bro broom. I'm probably gonna use it again to get all this dust another day. I'm just exhausted. It took me three hours to do this. So yeah, three hours of sweeping is is ex exaggerating. Um, I mean, it's exhausting. Can't even talk. <laughs> Ooh, it's dusty in here. All right. Just a little before and after. So as you can see, it's small sea as trash. A lot of dirt. That dirt is still going to be there with this brush. I'm going to have to get a, a portable power washer. I found some portable power washer. I'll probably do a video on that, a review on that. A portable power washer. You just have to have a lot of water, which is going to be the challenging part. Providing water for the power washer because it's a big space. But this broom did a really good job. All that moss it got off, all those cans in the corner, all those rocks. I pretty much got everything that I could. This is the after video right here. See, it's beautiful. Came out really nice, really, really nice. It's just that dirt, you know, I gotta get all that dirt out, but all those cans and those little pebbles and rocks and glass is all taken out. Looks way better. I'm so happy about it. It's, it's really um, accomplishing when you, when you do something like this. It take all day, it took about three hours, but it was well worth it. But that's about it. That's my review for the Quickie Bulldozer Broom. Don't forget that you can check it out in the link below. And while you're at it, like, comment, and subscribe because I'll be back with more how-tos and reviews.